Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us tonight. The Sioux City Community School Board has adopted its fiscal year 2024 budget tonight, which included a one cent reduction in the district's proposed tax levy rate. That's right. The total budget for fiscal year 24 is about $242 million. School Board President Dan Greenwell says the district is in good financial health. Greenwell says the district will be able to avoid staffing cuts while still accounting for nearly $185 million in expenditures. This year, uh, the current appraisals, not the new ones, but the current ones didn't go up by much. Uh, and so uh, uh, we're managing we're managing our, our tax levy very responsibly with the uh, with the citizens in mind. Greenwell noted what he called drastic inflation and recently released property tax valuations in Sioux City. Those valuations will impact property taxes in the fall of 2024 and spring of 2025. Based on those valuations, citizens will see the property tax levy rate drop in fiscal year 2025. I can assure you uh, that the tax levy will go down next year. Uh, we, we, we don't need that kind of revenue, local tax revenue, on these uh, higher appraised values. Something we're very cognizant of. Factor that could impact the property tax levy rate going forward. Governor Kim Reynolds signed into law the Students First Act, which will give public school students nearly $7,600 in state education funds to spend on a private school education. That starts next school year, but Greenwell says that won't impact the budget they adopted tonight. And that's all because the student census, which is the basis for state funding to schools, is from October 1st of this school year, not next school year.